Hey, what is up guys? Jay Bumblefly here for seeing you Nitro Plus Blasters Heroines Infinite Duel. Ooh, that was a mouthful. Um, today we're just going to be going through the story. And I'm going to use my main. Just get this over with very quickly. Um, there's really no cutscenes I can show you. Because, um, yeah. PlayStation thinks that, yeah. We'll do the first duel against, mm, I forgot how to say your name, um, Ethica, yeah, yeah. I, at first I was confusing her with Mara Musa, um, so Saya is a spacey character. You space out your opponents very easily because most of our moves have great range. This game also has like basic fighting game mechanics too, like strong, weak, medium attacks. Um, you have assists. Um, you have meter. You have charge attacks and um, all that stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was really, that was really easy. But this is only the first fight. Crap, she grabbed me. Crap, she grabbed me. Crap, crap, she grabbed me. Crap, she grabbed me. Crap, crap, she grabbed me. Grab attack, grab attack, grab, grab attack. I forgot how I do that attack. Not that one. But that one works too. Yeah, most of her attacks like, most of her weak attacks like juggle really well with themselves. Like this. Or like this. Um, what else, what else should I talk about? Wait, let me make sure my mic is on, yeah. Okay, right there we just met Sonico, which is the person that just introduced us to this fight. Um, she gave us a D phone, which is made by Asylum, which I don't think you should be taking phones from people that work at a place called Asylum. But, yeah, it's a deep phone. She um, can contact you whenever she needs to throughout the story. Um, I think she only does it like one time, though. Only real thing that... You see, what's happening here actually is that all these heroines have um, been transported here by Al Exit X Mortis, and um, they don't know why they're here, so they're, and they're all corrupted. So basically, they're just gonna fight each other, and your character, wh whoever it may be, um, fights all the other characters until they get. Ooh, perfect. Till they get to our exit Mortis, and they fight them to go back so she can send everybody back to their home world. Two of this combo so well into each other. 
<laughs> and that'll do it. And this is Al right here. Al got interrupted by a cutscene there, but Al is the original version of Al X Mortis. Um, all these characters are from like Japanese novels, so I really don't know where they're from because I don't think they're like actual manga, but they're more or less, yeah, novels. Crap, she grabbed me. That does so much damage when you combo those two into each other. I really like this um, set that I'm running. Oh yeah, let me talk about um, blast mode. Basically, if your um, health gets low, you might want to go into um, blast mode because it um, re fully, um, not fully, but um, refills your um, health for a short amount of time. So, I'll let her beat me up some. Come on. Computers are really stupid until they get to like the harder levels. Yeah. So, you launch blast mode, and you can see that my health and my meter is going up rapidly. It only lasts for a short amount of time though. That should be it. Yeah. We have the fourth duel against. This is Muramusa. Let's see if there's a cutscene. Nope, we're just going straight into the fight. I've already beat the story for one time, so I already know what's going on. But, um, if you ever want to see me do another story, which is the aftermath of this story, or do the story again with another character, um, let me know in the comment section below. I really don't care which one it is. Um. There we go. My goal here is to like get a high score because the story itself is like, I mean, it's a good story and all, but it's not like one of the best ones. I wouldn't say it's, a, obviously it's not one of the best ones because it's based, it's a fighting game, so please don't be the one. Oh my god. What does that even do? I don't even know what that assist does. Um, but yeah, the story isn't that good because one, it's a fighting game and the main aspect is to fight. If you, like, RPGs have, like, one of the best stories because they're story based and all the decisions that you make affect the story. But if you lose in a fighting game, all you gotta do is just like restart the match that you lost on. So, 
plus the story won't be the best. It's it's just giving them a reason to fight. But um, yeah, it's just a fighting game. I mean, I really can't exfoliate that anymore. Over halfway done, and we're on the fifth battle. <clears throat> Wait, no, yeah. So yeah, Mora, Mora, Mora. I hate this character whenever I fight against her because basically she's just a spacey, and spaceys do horribly against spaceys in this game. So it's not a good matchup for anybody. I think that Saya is still in the advantage just because she has more range. But it's not that much of an advantage. What you saw there was a meat explosion. Which it was a meat mine. But it also trapped your opponent. It's really useful in the fact that it can um... You can damage your opponent while they're in it and while they're in the hit stun coming out of it. She she has no health, look at this. No health at all. Dead. So basically that's a block string trap where if you do the down charge, it'll push the um guard back into the um meat bomb. That was also an anti air meat bomb. Oh crap, I tried to set up the bomb. Every character has two jumps, a dodge, and they can air recover if they get hit in the air. They can ground recover if they get hit on the ground. Pretty basic things. She is such a play, playful character. She's so carefree. Really is the next character we're gonna be fighting. Um, she's a melee based character, so she's in a disadvantage, sort of, whenever it comes to her getting in on me. And um, yeah. I really don't play the projectile game that much with um, Saya, so. It's not really going to be that much of a challenge for this reel. I play more of the um, attack space game. Like, I space my attacks out like this. Get them to block or either push them back. I approach a lot with um, this thing because it's really safe. Um, this move has a lot of range. I wonder what a score is at right now. I can't really see it. It's 700. Ooh, where are we at? 2 million? That is awesome. Or is that how much, how many points of damage we're done? We've done. In that case, bang, 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 bang. <laughs> Overkill is way too good. Let's shoot for three million in this. I'm sure we can get it.
Oh, we're already at five million. Oh my gosh. We're breaking goals like nothing. Like, basically we just got a call from um, Sonico saying that we should be on the lookout for our ex Mortise. So, that was a, that's basically what happened. I know I say basically a lot, but that's what I'm doing. I'm simplifying what just happened. I don't think I've ever seen that intro from um, Saber. I always saw her like transform into that costume right there that you see. She usually just wears a suit and like transforms into that costume. Oh crap, she grabbed me. Crap, she grabbed me. Crap, crap, she grabbed me. Right. Grab attack. Grab, grab, grab attack. Crap, she grabbed me. Grab me, grab me y'all, grab me y'all. This is absolute chaos. Oh crap, she blocked it. Was honestly way too much. All right, now we'll be going on to the final duel, which is against Al X Mortis herself. Saya, yeah, that name is way too long. You did not have to make that name so long. Whoa, my gosh. All right, Miss Intro here. Why, why don't I get anything that special? Let me just jump here because I already know. Yo, what you standing there for? She just plays really smart. You'll see me using a lot of my space moves. Um, and my assists a lot because they come out really they charge really fast and um, they have a lot of pit boxes and you also see me do this oh crap wrong move see me do a lot of that a lot of air assisting and um a lot of meat bombing because that only that stops her from attacking me while i'm on the ground because if i do an air assist she won't be able to hit me on the ground obviously and um if i do the meat bomb that'll stop her from pushing forward oh crap Catching her in the air is also really good because she has horrible air attacks. The only one she has that's actually good is her um, anti-air and she'll only use that whenever you're right in her face and she knows that you have no more options. So I'm going to go ahead and blast here just to keep my health up. And this should be it. That is the end of... And here are the credits. Marvelous Games. XC Games.
Examu Nitro Plus Nitro Plus Blasters everyone's over there do you have the cast with all their voice actors which are which did a excellent job excellent job all of them um, original work with Nitro Plus and all that and all that you guys can let's pause the video whenever you need to to go back and look at all these names and give them their respect man because they did a awesome job on this game um, I would have to say that this game's story itself was really well laid out and some things were really predictable at times like you can tell that Al Agzef Mortis um, was basically a corrupted Al because of the way that they shaded, um, they tried to like shade out some certain parts to where it didn't look like Al, but they didn't do such a good job on that. But in other, any other place, I, I just love the game. I can't get enough of it, and I just got it. Um, if you guys want to see more of this, um, make sure to tell me in the comment section below. Show me by hitting that like button. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button. You won't regret it. I promise you. <laughs> um, that's all I have to say. Enjoy the rest of the credits. This is Jay Bonfly signing out.